So what is up guys, Killer Gaming today back with a brand new episode of my top 5 picks for this week. Hopefully you guys are having a super sick day and today we are on episode 17. Wow, it's come so far. Hopefully we're going to keep up with this series because I really do enjoy doing it every single week. So as always guys, in no particular order, these mods, here are my top 5s. And to start off is going to be the Super Skyrim Bros Special Edition. I had so much fun with this mod, it was absolutely incredible. It was funny, it's really in depth as well, and the amount of tent to detailing within this mod is absolutely insane. This is for the Xbox One and for the PC. Highly recommend checking this out, even if you're not a massive fan of Mario. Personally, myself, I'm not a great fan of Mario. It wasn't like my one of my best childhood games ever, but just going back and knowing the franchise in-game in conjunction with Skyrim, it does look absolutely insane worth grabbing as well there's a ton of different levels there's loads of bosses as well there's loads of individual things ripped from the game put into skyrim as well it is really good honestly i had so much fun making that video if you wanted to check out our full video mod showcase review on the channel then obviously that was monday's video it was the first video go and check that one out it was so much fun i really enjoyed this one and at 500 and 24 MB. There's a lot in this mod and that obviously is a accurate MB download for this because as I said it is kind of huge for this mod. And for an next spot is going to be the Green Arrow. This was absolutely insane. This is for Xbox One and for PC. Worth grabbing this one too. Really did enjoy this one. You get I believe four different armors and two weapons. One dagger and a bow and all four different armors from various different places that the Green Arrow has been from. Really did enjoy this mod showcase. We've covered a ton of this mod author's armors prior to this video as well and they've always been incredibly well detailed they're absolutely awesome uh, i believe actually the author does have the youtube channel which i linked in my mod showcase review for the green air so if you want to go and check out his youtube channel then i'd highly recommend doing that as well just because he goes into way more depth than i ever will just because they're his mods as well also he's opened up a request kind of thing as well on his channel so go over to his channel bump in a quest if you have a set of armor or you want something made absolutely amazing Amazing. Cannot praise this guys enough. It was absolutely awesome. And for our next one is going to be for Better Sun. Now I really did enjoy this one. I think it's a great addition to have to anyone's set of sort of you know overhaul mods. This one's really nice. Adds almost a massive lens flare to the sun itself. It just projects itself down a little bit more better than it usually would. Um, as you can tell on screen now, some really nice footage. Very small but very subtle at the same time. It's absolutely awesome. Uh, keep an eye out for this one as well because obviously there's loads of updates coming as well obviously the lens effects do look absolutely amazing and i highly recommend grabbing this one too and for our penultimate spot is going to be the wolf knight armor this armor was absolutely beautiful it was kind of like a spin-off of the vanilla kind of armor that's in game it's heavily detailed throughout individual parts of this armor as well but what i love most about this is just for the fact of that this armor is very diverse it actually kind of connects in with the lore of skyrim if you kind of like lore friendly stuff that obviously are based around the vanilla based game within Skyrim then this is a nice addition to add to your game too I really did enjoy this armor as I say we did a full mod shakers review on request on the channel go and check that out I really enjoyed this mod I'm not gonna lie it is perfect for people that are running a normal game don't want anything ludicrous mod wise but they just want to add something just to spice up the game obviously if you're running for it for a second time then i'd highly recommend grabbing this there's a ton of different versions up and there's a load of different updates as well great one to grab and for a final spot this was absolutely amazing i really did enjoy this mod i actually spent like literally probably about four hours after i did the actual mod showcase review which was yesterday it is going to be the summonable army of exploding chickens this was really fun it's so easy to obtain as well this is on all platforms for pc xbox one and ps4 not only the fact of it's pretty well easy to get all you need to do is go to dragon's reach speak to one of the mages in there grab the book for the summoning thing obviously they add chicken eggs into the game obviously once you've got chicken eggs you can then go to the forge and make these individual little incubated eggs you throw them out as a kind of like a spell and they spawn the little vanilla chickens that you get obviously anything that touches them or they particularly peck then they explode it was absolutely hilarious and then obviously you get the tomb or the summoning spell to spawn two massive chickens which i believe are kind of be like the cockerel and sort of the um, normal chicken or sort of the hen um basically mummy and daddy chicken with all the little baby exploding chickens it was absolutely hilarious really did enjoy it and i felt myself 
and I felt after the video I just wanted to just run around within myself and just sort of explode things and see how many of these things I could get on the screen without the game crashing. Download size of 1.49 MB is definitely worth grabbing because it's hilarious, worth a try as well guys, you will not be disappointed with this mod. So guys that has been my top 5 for this week, hopefully you guys really did enjoy this video, I love making these top 5s near the end of the week. If you guys enjoyed any of the mods as well, let me know in the comment section below and also as always guys for each and every single week, let me know what top 5 mods you have been playing for this week as well. Hopefully you guys did enjoy, if you did, like, comment and subscribe for more daily content obviously feedback is much appreciated let me know how you think the channel is going uh, i'm going to be opening up nexus uh, mod showcase reviews next week as well going forward which i'm really psyched about because we haven't been there for a very very long time we've kind of been camping on the bethesda.net side of it so we are going to dive on to the other side of the fence for that one but guys until the next one killer kev here and killer kev out